Hello YouTube, this is Charlie here. Today I'm going to be making another sluice box. Um, I'll show you what I'm using to make the sluice box, so follow me. With it being Wisconsin, you're gonna get snow. But what I'm using is I'm gonna take a piece of this old swimming pool I got here use that to make a sluice box. I got plenty of material so I'll be back in a bit. So what I did is I took part of the top rail which if you look at it it should work pretty decent for a sluice. I'll end up using this. I've got the ends marked where I'm going to cut them to make a nice straight edge on both ends and then I have some more of this matting that I'm going to put in there and use that with my expanded metal and see if that flow works better with the pump that I have because my big one here yeah, I think it's more going to be a river or fast-moving creek setup, but uh, I think it should still work. But for at home, I believe this is the best way to go. So once I get this cut up, I'll be back and show you guys what it looks like. Now that I have that cut up, it looks like it'll work decent. The only thing that uh, I might want to do is trim the one side up it is a little bit higher than the other um, or I might be able to flatten down this edge just a little bit um, just to bring it down uh, yeah I think I'll do that at least up to this first ridge here across here try and get that bend down a little bit more and see if I can get it a little bit flatter so both sides match up nice and then I'll make a funnel end but since I'm using my water diverter I'll end up making a cap for the end of this so I can actually turn my water and face it back to the back side of the sluice that way it's got more rolling action in the back end of the sluice box and then that should help with the material working its way down on the sluice so I'm gonna start getting that put together sorry that I'm not recording everything in one go I have to use my phone yet um, and the case that I've got it does not work in my makeshift tripod which is right there all right well I'm gonna get started on that and I'll be right back well I finally got it all together uh, water flow looks a lot better in this one as you can see I got the expanded metal in there I've got a makeshift mat that I had made a while back that I'm gonna try for the top of this see if that helps out but the water flow in here is looking good. And it's running in there. I think this one will work a lot better. Because the other one, that one's about as tall as I am. And I'm 6'2", so it's a bigger box. Might end up using that one for a high banker or something. But that's it for tonight. And for action, remember to leave a like, uh, comment, and subscribe. It helps me grow my channel. Thank you, everyone. Good night.